I want to talk about New York Mets outfielder Kevin Pillar, who took one off his face on Monday night. 94-mile-an-hour fastball thrown in his direction by Braves reliever Jacob Webb. Got out of control. He lost control. Did not brush him back. Did not mean to brush him back. There's no bad blood, supposedly. There's, you know, there's always competition between Braves and Mets. But Kevin Pillar, as it was a frightening moment on Monday, brought out the lineup card Tuesday. Let everyone know he's okay. And then had this to say to the media. I know in this scenario, I can't speak about all the scenarios, but I know this guy didn't want to hit me. I know he didn't want to hit me in the face. Uh, the bases were loaded, and it was a one nothing game. And accidents do happen. So, uh, you know, in that regard, there's – you know, I know he feels bad. I know me and him have talked last night, today, and uh, I'm almost more worried about him than I am myself because I know I saw his reaction and I know how tough that could be on someone who feels, uh, you know, responsible for someone getting injured, how, how he feels. And I just tried to relay that message to him that, you know, I know that it was unintentional and he needs to continue to to, to be confident and uh, believe in himself and his stuff and uh, that I'll be fine. Love that. Oof. Love that brotherhood of men and understanding that mistakes are sometimes exactly that and ball gets away, wants to let a, another competitor know, hey, keep doing what you're doing, what you've done, you know, has broken my face. I mean, he meets with the media with a piece of gauze up his nostril, which is just totally blown up. Two black eyes to basically say, hey, you know, a very human moment. And I wanted to point that out because I just love that about sports in general and baseball as well. I, I, I do dig that. And I just wanted to say to Kevin Pilar, Pilar good on you. And to, you know, everybody, I, I just want, if you will, for it's the mo- like, look, it's the most feel good, broken face story I could ever think of <laughs> um, in the years that I've I've covered any sport outside of Anquan Bolden. Well, <laughs> that's amazing, too. But. So and Rich, Kevin walked into the clubhouse yesterday mm-hmm. and said, am I in the lineup or what? Like that was his first yeah. comment when he walked in. Everybody. And I've never met him, and I've heard from people who cover the sports saying that's who he is, and he's a good human on the planet, and we, and we appreciate that. Hey, you watched all the way to the end. Thanks for that. Watch more right here.